The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Greece, weighing in at 241 pounds, four. It's time for our first match of the night, guys, and it looks like we have quite the contest coming up. And good luck to those who have to follow this one. You're going to need it. Guys, how do you think the champ looks heading into this match? He looks a little relaxed to me. Maybe it's because the title's not on the line here. I don't know. Either way, I can tell you once the bell rings, he better be ready to go. As a list of victims that have been dismembered at the hands of Brock Lesnar continues to grow. I don't think he can be put in a type of match or have a match stipulation that prevents him from still being the odds on favor to win. The unpredictability of a triple oh, threat match makes this almost impossible to predict. Any one of these three can walk out of here the winner. Stiff headbutt. Nasty drop. Good 
Some superstars who have competed in a triple threat match feel it's a good idea to have both a finishing move that brings you to a pinfall attempt on your opponent and a submission move that can make your opponent tap out. Here's a cover. And there's a kick out at one. Not yet. Flarian. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Byron, before you mention the strategy, some superstars have implemented for competing in a triple threat match, and that includes having a finishing maneuver to put someone away for the one, two, three in a submission to make them tap out. There are many superstars in WWE who can do just that, which makes them even more dangerous to opponents. The way I look at it is you can never have enough weapons at your disposal, especially in something like a triple threat match. If a superstar can defeat someone by pinfall and submission, to me, they increase their chances of victory in a match where the odds are against them to begin with. In February of 2017, SmackDown Live was lit thanks to an epic triple threat match for the WWE Championship. Champion Bray Wyatt defended the title against former champions John Cena and AJ Styles. This battle overflowed with mayhem before the match even got underway thanks to Luke Harper attacking his former leader, Bray Wyatt. It's not often that the WWE Championship is incapacitated before a title defense. John Cena and AJ Styles rekindled the rivalry with a renewed enthusiasm for destroying one another. Bray Wyatt ended the match and made up for lost time as the Eater of Worlds used his body as a weapon. It was pure chaos as AJ Styles followed suit with an unbelievable array of aerial attacks on both superstars. And John Cena continued to fight back in hopes of winning a record-breaking 17th World Championship. All three superstars pulverized each other with every move in their respective arsenals. When it looked like another air assault was coming from AJ Styles, John Cena thwarted the attempt and then walked right into Sister Abigail from Bray Wyatt to end the conflict. In that victory, the WWE went further into the darkness that was the era of Wyatt. The superstar always needs to be ready. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. A competitor must be ready for the possibility that they'll fall victim to a two-on-one attack on a triple threat match. A great example of that was the triple threat match on SmackDown. Looking for the win. Nicely done. That's called making a stick. The shoulders are down. Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Showing off some of his speed there. This might be it. Oh, my. Putting it all on the line. He's playing with him now. You better stay right where he is. Look out! He's got the shoulders down. And the kick out. <laughs> yeah, try again. There is no way that is going to topple the Beast in front. I got a groove to Corey on that one. Oh, what impact. There's the pin. Can his opponent kick out? It's going to take a lot more than that to keep him down. Way too early. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. No, he reverses it. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, man, what a leg drop. you got to believe this one's over. He could do it here. And he's able to get out. The beast won't stay down. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Going for broke. Wow, huh? 
I gotta say that I'm in shock. I really thought Lesnar would look better here tonight. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. This has been a battle. He wants no part of the outside. Nailed it. What a strike. This capacity crowd starting to sense the end is near, and I don't disagree. There's a very real chance he might not be able to recover from this here in this triple threat match. And he goes for the pen. Two. I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. Man, oh man. Oh, the reversal by Brock Lesnar. Takes him down in a major way, too. Oh, my impact. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. Looking to end it here. This could be it. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. He needs to change something fast, guys. Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. Goes. That was impressive, Cole. Close line. He's got him down. Is this it? And the kick out. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. Oof. Oh, an elbow drop. And this has got to be it. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. How? Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyperextend your elbow. Harsh impact. He's going for the pin. Two. Kick out at two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gap. We've seen this before. Is he done? He somehow breaks free. Nice, but he clearly has next to nothing left to give here. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beat. Going to the cover. One. Oh, somehow! Wow, what's it going to take? Oh, he's such a tough target. Submission time! Doesn't appear to be locked in very well. No, he releases the hold. What in the world is he thinking? Does he not want to win? When this guy's on, look out. At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this one before somebody gets seriously injured. Reverses that one. The match isn't even over, and I can already tell you that this is one of the most exciting triple threat matches I have seen in a very long time. He wants no part of the outside. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. what he was looking for, Michael. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. Suplex! What's gonna happen now? His shoulders are down. Two! Barely at two and a half. With all the damage done, you have to wonder how much more it'll take. When this guy's on, 
Look out. Avoids trouble there. Oh, the reversal by Brock Lesnar. What have we got here? Beautiful technique. Irish whip. Back between the ropes. Oh, nasty impact. Boom! <laughs> Boom, what impact! Too quick for him there. And see, Face Buster! Warm up the bus. This one is over. Shoulders on the back. One, two, three! What a win. Talk about seizing opportunity. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Man, oh man, look at that. Look at him go. And here's the last look at this one. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks.